there, Sagittarius. Welcome to your general reading for March 2021 for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, and Rising Signs. Thank you guys so, so much for all the love and support. I appreciate you guys more than you could ever know. This is for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising Signs. I'm going to be doing things a little bit differently from now on so I can upload more videos. I will be separating your general reading along with your love life reading so they will be done as separate uploads so make sure that you are subscribed to me and that you double tap that bell to get notified of every upload i have okay so also i'm gonna try and go live again i know i was having trouble with the sound the last couple times i i try to go live it just did not sound good at all so i don't know what happened there I've got my mic set up again, and so hopefully it, it won't be the same thing when I upload. Okay, so here we go. Sagittarius. Remember, this is a general reading, so not all messages will resonate with everyone. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. We have the thinking man and the angel of balance. Okay, so... I feel that for some time you've been trying to figure out a way to find your balance emotionally, spiritually, physically, uh, mentally. Some of you have been uh, financially balanced. Uh, uh, you've been trying to get your foot back on track when it comes to your finances. I, I feel as though some of you have really been thinking and overthinking like what's next? How can I get it together? Especially if it has affected your romantic life. Some of you that are single... I know I said I was going to do your love life reading separate. It's okay if this takes on a love energy reading. I'm still going to uh, record your love life reading separate. Now, the thinking man is essentially like the air sign male, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. You may have air in your chart or you're just definitely in that contemplative mood of how can I get my shit together, basically. <laughs> Angel of Balance. Angel of Balance is here to let you know that they are guiding you. They are helping you, trying to come up with new ideas. They are aligning you with the people, places, situations, scenarios, things, whatever you may need. Uh, to get you aligned, yeah, there it is. I said financial otherwise, you know, um, earlier. So if you are worried about um, whether or not you can be financially stable, especially if you are in a commitment in a relationship or partnership, others of you, you have been single for quite some time and you're just like, how can I date? I can't even get my financial shit in order. <laughs> you know, like, how am I going to take somebody out on a date if like, I don't have any money? I don't have the money to buy myself clothes, to put gas in the car, to like take anyone out. Like I'm barely doing it. So I think that you're uh, minimizing what you have to offer someone. New beginnings for sure with the magician card here. I think spirit is definitely guiding you and aligning you to specific people, places, situations on, you know, how you need to move forward. Look at that. Beautiful. To make that money, honey, right? King of Pentacles. Not gender-based. That's, you know... Uh, King of Pentacles is that king with the Midas touch. So if you're this thinking man, Aquarius, Super Gemini, you're really in your thoughts, trying to strategize and plan ahead on how to move forward, um, trying to find your balance within uh, work life relationship as well. If you're married or single or whatever it may be, I think that you have been kind of stuck in your head for a while about whether or not you've made the right decisions, the right choices. Um, you know, I think that you have good news coming to you, especially news in regards to money. If you've been applying for jobs or promotions and you feel like it just hasn't happened or, you know, it's everything is happening very slowly. I think that you have the Midas touch here with the King of Pentacles and the Magician card. Um, you know, you have all the tools, all the, you know, I was going to say the people. So you might have the tools in terms of your skills and abilities and experience, but you may also have the right set of people as your resources, right, to move forward. And maybe you've been blindfolded uh, or you've been blinded about a specific situation or scenario within the home, relationship, at work, in a community, in a business, uh, but you were ready for a new beginning and then somehow that fizzled out and there's no new beginnings and you're just like, wait. I thought I got hired. <laughs> I thought I got the job. I thought this was still coming in, still coming through. And the pages never progressed to, you know, a, a night 
with action forward movement and then the only night you have here is knight of pentacles which is you know let's be real slowest night in the slowest night in the deck slow as fuck knight of pentacles but you do make it to that king of pentacles energy it's time for you to remember who you are the power that you hold the the power of your charisma as well i mean daughter romance doesn't just have to be about your love partnership and relationship but also how you come across you know i'm not saying use your sexual prowess to like get your way or anything right you might get in trouble for that but you know definitely you have a way of charming people and getting people to you know side with you see your point of view you have a way of and i'm hearing it this way okay you have a way of working the room okay so that is important for some of you especially if it's this is a, like um within your family a partnership the community if you're worried about maybe your partner's family and whether or not they will like you or accept you because maybe you're in a tough spot financially or emotionally or physically health you know health wise or whatever and you're just afraid you know that you won't be accepted that maybe you're thinking they're they're gonna tell you you're not good enough for this person you know those are things that you you tell yourself in your head out of fear and it's time to stop that you have success and victory all the way here it may not happen as quickly as you'd like it to but there is forward movement and I think that is important for you to realize. Um, I think that some of you may also be worried that um, the strategies and the plans or actions that you may have taken in the past or that you're currently doing in the works are going to keep you out of balance. I think that um, I'm hearing the words like they took me for a fool i went along with it and now i've got to fight back to where we were at and that's seven of wands so that's exactly the energy that i'm feeling um especially in regards to you know soulmate energy relationship in the past or a long-standing relationship and you know in love in business or otherwise maybe you've been with this company for a long time and you know you thought you'd go along with whatever changes they wanted to do and then it turned out that it wasn't the way they had promised you and now you're like did i just shoot myself in the foot you know a uh, long-standing uh partnership or relationship here yeah see when i said and now you feel like you're in the outs like you just shot yourself in the foot like maybe you made a deal with the devil is what i'm hearing but it, ultimately things will work out in your favor you have the wheel of fortune whatever changes are meant to happen it is meant for your highest good and if you are not ready for change or a uh, shift in your environment, relationship, business, or otherwise. Um, if you have been in a low vibing energy, spirit is already, if you can't make up your mind, I'm going to make it for you is basically the energy I'm getting from them. Okay. It's like, no, 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 no. Look at that. Being like this, two of swords, not being able to move forward, stuck and stagnant. It came out in reverse and look at that. Okay, similarities here because guess what? The angel of balance says, okay, you're not gonna decide for yourself. We're gonna show you what your next step should be. We're gonna push you in a way where you have no choice but to see that things were meant to play out this way with the angel of balance, the wheel of fortune, the two of swords in reverse. Spirit has shown you that everything is going to be okay. Stop worrying. Things will work out. Perhaps ideally, um, you know, you're feeling as though things aren't the, working out the way I had wanted them to. This isn't my original plan, my original idea. I, I keep hearing like I was a fool, you know, that type of energy. Um, any more cards for me? No. Okay, this feels like it's done. All right, let's move on to the angel answer. So yeah, I feel that you'll be okay. Don't worry, Sagittarius. Things will work out. You know, it is important to have good and open, honest dialogue, communication. And when I said that, no joke, spirit is like, please tell them. Please let them know. It is important for them to communicate clearly. I think that if you got into the situation of saying, you know, um, 
I'll go along with your plan if I get A, B, and C, and now you're in this energy of reconsidering and thinking, okay, this wasn't this wasn't the way it was promised. This wasn't, you know, um, how I had hoped for. And now you feel like you're going, I'm hearing quicksand. You feel like you're going in deep, like quicksand. You're being pulled down and you feel like you almost can't see your way out. There is a need for you to strategize to be able to move forward. But at the end of the day, Sagittarius, there will be a peaceful resolution between you and your love partner, your business partner, a situation in your community. Just it is important for you to remain positive. Okay, Sagittarius, that is your message for March 2021. I will link your love life reading here once it is uploaded. Thank you guys once again. Make sure you hit the thumbs up, like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys very soon. Have a wonderful rest of the month. Take care. Bye.